Today, I'm doing a Minecraft mob battle with my friends, but whatever color we pick turns our mob into something super special. But what does that mean? Well, basically, Zoe, we have a bunch of different command blocks over here, and whatever color we flick on will turn the mob we have inside of this fence right here into something that color. That sounds super cool. Holy cow, do me, do me. Uh, no, Nox, we're not gonna do you. Uh, fine. But actually, Nox, your side is on the other side of this wall, and you're gonna have five minutes to spawn in your first mob, so best of luck in this first round. Wait, am I on my own team? Uh, yeah, you're all by yourself. What? Yeah, sorry, Nox. You have to go on the other side. Uh, fine. Okay, Zoe, are you super excited for this color mob battle? Yeah, I am so excited. But what do you want to do first? Well, first, I kind of want to do a little something to give us an advantage in this mob battle. What is it? So I set up some secret cameras over on Nox's side. So as soon as I look inside of this camera monitor, we can see exactly when he's going to spawn it. And then we can make the perfect counter to it. That's so cool. Let's spy on him. Okay, let me just look into my camera monitor and oh my. My goodness, Zoe, look at this. We can see on Nox's side. Huh, there's Nox. Ha, I think for this round, I'm gonna start off with something kind of cool just to test this out. I'm thinking I'm gonna put an ocelot in here. Wait, did he just spawn down on an ocelot? Like, basically like a little cat? Ha, and now, looking at all these colors, I know a cat that's purple. Bang! And what in the world? Guys, wait, it just turned into a catnap. That's crazy. Catnap is super strong. Holy cow, it's catnap now. That's insane. Oh, gosh, Zoe, this isn't good at all. Nox has catnap who is extremely strong, and we're gonna have to think of a super good counter to this. Yeah, what do you think we should do? Zoe, I'm thinking for this first round, we spawn in a mushroom. A mushroom? What is even that? Well, basically, it's like a normal cow, but it's red. Look how cute this thing is. Oh my gosh, that looks like something Nox would really like. And wait a second, Zoe, what if we use like red on red? That sounds like a great idea. Okay, so all I think I need to do is walk over to this red piece of wool right here and hit the button. And wait, it says mob spawned in, Zoe. Dax, look! What is it? And what in the world is this thing? It looks like Iron Man! It kind of does look like Iron Man, but wait, I think this is like the Hulkbuster Van, so maybe he's like even stronger than the normal one. This is crazy! We're for sure gonna win! What in the world? I know we can get something like that, but oh, wait a second, Zoe. Should we look at Nox's side again and see if he spotted any more mobs? Yeah, let's do it! Okay, let me look in the camera monitor, and oh gosh, guys, it looks like Nox is spotting in a bunch of people, and wait, is he trying to cut the grass right now? Come on, hurry up and start! Uh, what in the world is he trying to do, Zoe? I have no clue. He is so weird. But he did spawn in a lot of catnaps, and honestly, that makes me a bit nervous. I mean, I know this Iron Man over here is really big, but do you really think he's strong to take out all those catnaps? You want to spawn in a few more? Yeah, maybe we should. Let me walk up to him and grab his spawn egg, and I guess we can spawn in, like, what do you think, like, three or four of these? Yeah, I think, like, four of them would be good. Okay, there we go. Number four in perfect Zoe. I think our army is basically good to go now. Should we see if he wants to drop the walls? Yeah, let's go ahead and ask him. Okay, Nox, well, I think me and Zoe are basically ready to go for this first round in the mob battle. Are you ready to lose? I'm ready to win this round. No shot, but let's see who's gonna win this first round. Take out all the catnaps. Whoa, it's skinny catnap. That's insane. This thing is huge. Is that Iron Man? Yep, this is the Iron Man suit. Me and Zoe have like the best color picked out. No, I think actually Nox has the best color picked out because the catnap is purple. What? That doesn't even make any sense. And Nox, what in the world are you using right now? It's a trumpet. But you can't use a trumpet to interfere with the mob battle. That's cheating. I'm not. I'm just playing my instrument. Come on, guys. We can do this. And yes, a bunch of the catnaps are getting taken out, Zoe. This is awesome. I knew Iron Man would win. <sighs> Catnap's supposed to beat this giant thing. Yeah, he is pretty giant, and I think this is the Iron Man armor that's used to, like, defeat the Hulk, so there's no way a little tiny skinny catnap could win this. Yeah, this is really unfair. Just a few more hits, and perfect, Zoe. Look at that. We just won the first round. That was too easy. Uh, I feel like that one was kind of unfair. No, it wasn't unfair at all, Nox. You went ahead and picked your own color. You should have got something better. <sighs> Fine, whatever. I'm gonna win the next round, though. Zoe, that was so perfect. We completely crushed Nox in that round. Yep, the Iron Men were so strong. Yeah, they were like crazy strong, but okay, how about we use our cameras again to see what Nox is doing for the second round? Let's do it. Okay, well, let me just look into the cameras and, uh, wait a second, Zoe, uh, do you see that? Uh, I don't see anything. It just says the cameras can't be located. Wait, what in the world do you think happened to them? Oh my gosh, I bet you when you dropped the wall, the cameras got destroyed. Oh gosh, this is a good Zoe. How are we supposed to win now if we don't have cameras on Nox's side? I have no clue. We're not even able to cheat right now. Prepare for landing. It, uh, wait, what in the world was that, Zoe? Oh no, is that that creepy hobo? 
wait, what in the world is the hobo doing back here again? Oh my gosh, this guy's so weird. And where did he get a helicopter? Hey, what's going on, you two? Uh, hey, uh, Mr. Hobo, and uh, why do you have a helicopter? Well, first of all, I'm not really a hobo anymore, and the name's Garfunkel. Just make sure you remember that for next time, okay? Oh, okay, I'm sorry, Mr. Garfunkel, but uh, it still doesn't really explain why you have a helicopter. Well, I'm doing a lot better after some uh, legal litigation issues that I faced earlier underneath the bridge. So, uh, you know, after that little incident over there, I came into some cashola, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> oh, okay, I guess I kind of know what you're saying, but uh, me and Zoe are in the middle of a mob battle, so we kind of need to figure out what we're going to do, so can you kind of just go away? Well, perfect, actually, because... Because uh, Garfunkel's Emporium of Winning Mob Battles is uh, back open again for business. Oh, gosh. Okay, well, what do you have for us this time? Well, this time, I actually have this little device right here. It's a little uh, one-way glass maker. Wait, a one-way glass maker, Zoe? This might be perfect because we don't have our cameras anymore. Yeah, that's like exactly what we need. How much do you want for it, Mr. Hobo? Well, right now, as you can see, money's not really an object of something I need. So I'm more looking for a one-to-one -one trade of something, you know, kind of valuable you guys think is special that I don't currently possess. Oh, okay. So uh, what if I just walk over here and look at this, Zoe. Look, we have a brand new helicopter and here you go. I'll give you this helicopter for that thing. Get my helicopter back. No, I'm just gonna throw it off if you don't give it to me. Whoa, don't do that. Don't do anything harsh. I'm trying to help you here. Okay, see, I'm trying to help you too by giving you this helicopter. So go ahead and give me the thing back. Oh, uh, fine. Here you go. Okay, perfect. Thank you, Mr. Garfunkel Hobo. And uh, oh gosh, wait, I can't figure out how to put your plane down. Put it down. Okay, okay, I'm trying, I'm trying. Okay, there you go, Mr. Mr. Uh, Garfunkel. And yes, Zoe, look, you got the one-way glass maker. Yep, here you go. Thank you so much, and it was a pleasure doing business with you. Yeah, I guess so, but uh, I'll see you guys later. Later, Mr. G. Okay, so let me just try out this one-way glass maker, and let's see what it does. And oh my goodness, Zoe, wait, do you see that? Yeah, it looks super good, and Knox can't see us at all. This is perfect. Let's see what he's going to try and do for this round. This is going to be kind of a tougher round. Ha, huh, I think for this round, I'm going to spawn in a chicken. Wait, did he literally just spawn in? the chicken, Zoe. Are you serious? It's making me think of food, and I'm so hungry. Huh. And I think I know of a big orange bird. The sun god. Wait, the sun god? You think he's actually gonna get it? And did it work? Oh my gosh! What in the world? Zoe, wait, how did he get that thing? Jeez, Louise, that thing is so realistic looking. Holy cow, this thing is insane! It definitely is the sun god. Huh, but this thing is kind of small, so I'm gonna have to make it a ton bigger. Wait, what is he doing? Let me use the size-changing potion. And oh Oh my goodness, Zoe, this thing got ginormous. Oh my goodness. And look at its power. That's crazy. Bonk, 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 bonk. Oh gosh, this is honestly kind of scary. Okay, come on, Zoe. We have to think of something really good for this round. Well, what should we do? I'm thinking we need something like really big and super, super strong, Zoe. So maybe we should use like an iron golem or something. That would be perfect. And what color should we use? Let's see what's a good color. Honestly, I kind of want to use black. Yeah, that sounds like it would be super powerful. Okay, so first I have to make the iron golem. So let me grab some iron blocks and then I need a little pumpkin for the head. And we'll just build this up in both of these corners and smack the carved pumpkin on top. And perfect, Zoe, look at this. We have our super cool iron golem now. This guy is weird. What? How's he weird? He's just a normal iron golem, Zoe. He's just weird. He has those red eyes and they follow me wherever I go. Oh, uh, whatever. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and try our super cool command block and let's see what this ends up making for us. And look at that, Zoe. It's his mob spawned. Yep, look, it definitely spawned. Oh my goodness, this thing looks so cool now. Yeah, it is super cool, but it doesn't have any legs. Yeah, it doesn't have any legs, but I mean, it kind of floats around, so I think it's pretty powerful by itself, Zoe. Yeah, it looks like it's gonna be super cool. Should we spawn in some more? Yeah, let's go ahead and grab his spawn egg, and then we can build our whole army, but we do have to be careful, because I mean, Nox's person is like 20 times bigger than ours, so it could get a little bit scary. Yeah, this is definitely gonna be a close round. Okay, Nox, I think Zoe and I are ready for this round to start. Are you ready to lose another round to us? Uh, I definitely don't think you guys are going to win this one. No, we're for sure going to win. Let's drop the walls and see. And Nox, what in the world is this big thing? This is Umbat Fig, the sun god. Wait, the sun god? How'd you even get a sun god? And oh gosh, he's kind of cooking our golems right now, Zoe. That's a huge bird. Yeah, it's huge. Get him, guys. That is a super big bird. Uh, Nox, what did you even use to make this thing? <laughs> Orange. You used orange and what was like the base mob that you used it wait it's spawning at other creatures yeah of course he does he 
he's the sun god. He's literally a god. That is crazy. This is not looking good for us. We already lost a bunch of our troops. I think this thing is just getting stronger. Yeah, it is getting stronger. We don't have money golems left. Come on, golems. Keep fighting. Keep fighting. Oh my gosh. As soon as I get close, I get sent flying back like 20 feet. This is crazy. They've got nothing on a god. No, they definitely do. We're gonna win this. Just keep fighting a little harder, guys. And oh my gosh, this isn't fair. They're like shooting these huge beams from the sky. That's the power of the sun, the god hammer. Dex, I don't think we're winning this. Yeah, we only have like three golems left. Oh gosh, this is not good for us. And wait, what in the world is it charging up for right now? What is this move supposed to be? Time for its ultimate attack. Wait, its ultimate attack? That doesn't even make sense. And oh, come on. We have two people left. Why is this guy in the back doing nothing, Zoe? I have no clue. He's scared. It's because he's sucking the life from him. Look at his health bar. Wait, his health bar? Oh my gosh. Wait, was his health going up? Yeah, it was healing from him. What in the world? That's so rigged. And oh no, it just took out one golem. I think we only have one more left. This is not good. Come on, dark golem. Go fight him. You can do this. You're the sole survivor of our army. Please. And oh gosh, he just got taken out pretty quickly too. Yeah, we lost that round. Sorry, mortals, but you didn't play with the powers of the gods like I did. Oh my gosh. Okay, so we're definitely gonna have to get something better for the next round because that dark orb did not cut it. Yeah, we're gonna have to do so much better. Uh, Zoe, I can't believe we lost the last round. Those dark golds were so weak. Yeah, I think that we were probably stronger than them. Yeah, that was a little bit unfortunate, but we're gonna have to see what Nox is gonna try to do for this round, and then maybe we can think of something way better than that stupid dark golem. Ha, huh, I think for this next round, I have to come up with something even better than the sun god. I have the perfect idea. I'm gonna put in just this little itty bitty tadpole right here. Uh, wait, did he just spawn in a little tadpole, Zoe? Yeah, how is a tadpole supposed to be strong? And then now just mix with a little bit of green. Wait, what is this gonna do? And what in the world? Wait, Zoe, it made like a huge snake. I hate snakes. <laughs> the Naga's here. What in the world? I hate snakes too. And look how fast this thing moves around. It's honestly kind of freaking me out, Zoe. Yeah, I really don't like it. Uh, and since my ideas have been super bad for like the past round, I don't even want to think of anything. Do you have any good ideas for something we can do? Honestly, I kind of want to experiment this round. So how about you hop into the fence? Wait, you want me to hop inside of here, Zoe? Uh, why do you want me to do that? I just have an idea. I'm going to flick the green lever and I'm going to see what happens. Uh, okay, I guess let's see what this does. Here goes nothing. And Zoe, I don't think it did anything. I feel like exactly the same height. Do I look any different to you? Really? It said that the mob spawned in. What the heck? Uh, wait, what? Do I look different, Zoe? What's going on? Look next to you. Wait, look next to me. And oh my gosh, wait, it's like a huge me. Yeah, if anybody can take that snake down, it's a giant you. Oh, this is perfect, Zoe. You're a total genius. I couldn't even think of something like that. I know. I'm like the smartest person you know. Okay, so how about we grab this guy spawning? And I'm guessing we can spawn in a bunch of them. Even though he does have that Naga over there, if we have like a bunch of my people, we should be able to win, right? Yeah, definitely. And Zoe, since we still have some time before the wall is supposed to drop, why don't we head over to Nox's side and mess with him? Yeah, let's do it. But won't he see us if we go over there? Oh, yeah, of course he'll see us if we go over there. So maybe we should use a really cool invisibility potion. That way he won't know it's us. That would be awesome. So let me just walk into my inventory real quick and I'll grab it and come real close away. We're gonna both use it and look at this. Now we're completely invisible. Wait, I'm invisible? Can you see me doing the moonwalk? Uh, no, I can't see the moon. No, I can't see you doing the moonwalk. Are you sure you've been doing it? I promise I am. Uh, okay. Well, I don't really believe you, but let's go over to Nox's side and see what he's doing, okay? Let's go. And look at this. We're over on his side and oh man, this snake is a lot creepier in person. Yeah, it's also a lot bigger. Yeah, come here, Donna. Catch this potato. Uh, wait, is he literally shooting? a potato gun at him, Zoe. What's wrong with this guy? I have no clue, but probably a lot of things. Catch it in your mouth. Yeah, honestly, probably a lot of things are wrong with this guy, but since we're over on his side, what should we do to prank him? How about we do some TNT? Oh, TNT would be great. And actually, Zoe, I'm pretty sure there's like dynamite version, so we don't actually have to place down the TNT. Seriously? Let's do it. And let's see. What TNT do we want to use? And oh, wait a second. This one called the arrow dynamite sounds really cool. Drop it down. Let me just throw it right over here and whoa look at all those arrows that was crazy what in the world what was all that oh nox is totally freaking out and look how much damage his naga took yeah it took a lot of damage maybe if we keep doing this then we can drop the walls and he'll go down super fast oh no natalie are you okay natalie yeah did he just call his little snake thing natalie that's a little strange are you okay big girl it's all right it's a lady snake well you know what i think i'm just gonna
gonna throw down another one of these arrow dynamites and boom, there we go. Natalie, who's causing you to suffer like this? Sheesh, the health took some damage again. Yeah, it did, but I kind of feel bad. Nox sounds like he's really sad now. Yeah, maybe we should leave him and Natalie alone for a little bit. Yeah, maybe we should, but I'm sure there's something else we could do to prank him with, right? Like what? It, wait a second, Zoe. What if I just fly around with this super cool flamethrower and just start like firing it everywhere? Do it. That sounds so cool. Okay, let me just light it off and oh my gosh, look at this. Sheesh, the snake is on fire. Holy cow, is that fire? What's going on here? And wait a second, is that a flying flamethrower? Oh, wait a second. Nox can still see me. Let me just put it away. It. Oh gosh, my invisibility ran out. Dax, what are you doing here? Uh, hi, Nox. Uh, actually, I was uh, I was going to get you some food, and then I got lost, and then uh, I ended up here. You wanted to hurt my Natalie? No, no, no. Why would I want to hurt Natalie? She looks like You're a very nice guy. What? Nox, what's wrong with you? Stay away from my side. Stay away from my Natalie. Zoe, what in the world is wrong with that guy? I don't know. He's seriously crazy. Hey, you cheaters. Hurry up and drop the wall. I'm ready. Oh, uh, fine. You know what? I can drop the walls. We have more people than you anyways. There's no way you can beat us, Nox. Holy cow. Are those giant yous? Yes, they are giant meats. We have a bunch of daxes and just keep jumping this stupid dog and there's no way she can win. I bet they're like potatoes. Uh, potatoes. Like, no, Nox, you can't use a potato gun. That's cheating. Yeah, I can. Dax, it's okay. I know Nox's biggest fear. Ah, snowballs. Wait, you're actually, why are you afraid of snowballs? I don't like snow. It's cold. It's round and I don't like it. That doesn't really make any sense, Nox, but oh gosh, wait, it looks like a bunch of us are starting to lose. What's going on? No way. How much health? does the snake have? Oh my gosh. He has such high health. Stay away from me with those. Yeah, it's like regenerating instantly. What in the world? I think we may lose this. Come on, please. Please. And wait, Zoe, his health started to go down. Thank goodness. No, Natalie. Come on. Keep taking her out. There's no way she can win. Yeah, she's getting completely stopped now, Nox. You're so small, Natalie. Keep fighting. And wait, there's like three of ours left, but this thing only has like a little bit of health left. And yes, we won. Oh yeah. Haha, <laughs> Nox, you lost. Even with cheating with that potato gun, you still lost. I probably lost because you cheated. You hurt my Natalie earlier. What? No, I didn't do anything. What are you talking about? You're a filthy liar. I saw you with the flamethrower. You know what, Nox? Let's just move on to round number four. Fine. And send Zoe over there with you. I don't want any of those snowballs near me. One to two. Nox smells like poo. He smells like poo. I can't believe we actually ended up winning that last round, Zoe. That was way too close. Yeah, it was super close. But if we win this next round, we're going to be the mob battle champion. So why don't we spy through the glass and see what Nox is going to try and pull off? All right, little guy. You hop in there. We need to win this next round. Wait, what in the world did he spawn in? Is that just a little turtle? Yeah, it looks kind of cute. All right, little guy. I'm going to have to mix you with some red. Good luck. Wait, some red? What is this going to do for him? And ta-da! Wait, what? Zoe, it made a T-Rex. That's crazy. How did a T-Rex come from a turtle? Honestly, I have have no idea. That's honestly insane. Uh, and I'm not done yet. Let's make you bigger. Wait, he's gonna make it bigger? Oh, he's using the size changer. Not good. And oh my goodness, guys, it just got huge. It's looking over the wall. There you go, Lexi Rexy. What? He called it Lexi Rexy? What is wrong with this guy? Honestly, I just love that he's supporting women. Yeah, but Zoe, we're gonna need something really good to counter this. I mean, we wanna win this round so we can win the whole thing, right? Yeah, we definitely need to win this. Well, what's a good thing that we could spawn in it. Oh, wait a second. What if we spawn like a polar bear? A polar bear? That sounds awesome. I think polar bears are so cute. So let's see. Where is our little bear? It. Oh, yeah. Here's our nice little polar bear. Isn't he just adorable? So cute. And actually, instead of doing one of these colors, why don't we change one of the colors on top of this? What do you want to change it to? I want to make it white so we can get like the ultimate polar bear. The deadliest polar bear. Do it. So let me put this white block on top of this and and hit this and oh my gosh it says mob spawned yeah it definitely did look oh my gosh wait we got a boss bar too it says frost mail? yeah but i don't know where the head is oh it looks like the head's uh right here in the front side so you can see his little eyes and teeth over here are you sure it kind of looks like the head's over here wait that kind of looks like the head's over there it, uh, no zoe i think that's his butt ah his butt yeah, his head's definitely over here. I mean, I can see his eyes, can't you? Kinda, but why is he sleeping? I don't know. Maybe he's just like a little tired or something. And, oh, gosh. Wait, did you hit him? No, I got this ice crystal. What in the world? Now he's all mad. Uh, guys, what was that? Uh, that was uh, nothing, Nox. Don't worry about it. And, oh, my gosh. Zoe, get him to calm down. There it is again. Shh. 
Shh. You have to be quiet, Mr. Polar Bear. Oh, my goodness. He's totally freaking out. I don't know why. Well, I mean, we already have this super big, annoying guy. Stop doing that. Oh, my gosh. He's so annoying, Zoe. Yeah, I don't know why he's doing that. Uh, well, whatever. Okay, but we still do have a bit of time. So what do you say we go over to Nox's side? And wait, Zoe, you just put him to sleep. I know. I used this ice crystal. Oh, that was perfect. Now he's all calm again. Exactly. So you wanted to go over to Nox's side? Yeah, I think we should try to go over there again. But I'm going to need to be a little bit more careful by invisibility because last time he caught me. Yeah, no kidding. And wait a second. Zoe, you just gave me a great idea. Oh, my gosh. You're such a genius. What? What did I do? Well, I mean, you put the frost mount to sleep. So what if we try to put Nox to sleep? Oh, my gosh. Let's do it. And I'm thinking in order to do this, we're going to need to get him a little house. So why don't I grab us a nice house TNT? Have you ever heard of one of those before? Yeah, I have. Doesn't it just like spawn in a whole house? Yep, it'll spawn in a whole house. So let me place one down here and light it off. And oh my gosh, this is going to be so cool. Wait, what the heck was that? Holy cow, is that a house? Oh my gosh, Zoe, look at this. Nox has a huge house now. Yeah, this is awesome. But it looks like his T-Rex may destroy it. Oh yeah, it kind of does look like a T-Rex may destroy it. But we want to put him to sleep. So should we give him like a bed inside of there? Yeah, let's do it. Huh, this place is pretty homely. Look at the stuff inside the chest. Wait, there's stuff inside the chest too? Oh gosh, wait, I'm going to sneak in and just throw a bed in this corner. Quick, run out, run out, run out. I'm running, I'm running. Huh, how cool is that? Oh, look, a bed. Ah, I was getting kind of tired. Huh. Oh wait, this is perfect. So wait, Nox said he's getting kind of tired. I think he's going to go to sleep. Awesome. But just to make sure, should I use that ice crystal on him to put him to sleep? Yeah, Zoe, that's a great idea. Why don't you go ahead and use it on Nox? Here goes nothing. And wait a second. I think he's falling asleep now. Oh my gosh, you must have made him tired. Perfect. It worked. Okay, Zoe, I think we should just sneak inside and grab that really cool size changer from him. Me, 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 let's me, go. me, 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 Okay, let's go inside. Me, oh my me, gosh, me, he is me, such me, a me, loud me, sleeper, Zoe. Yeah, and he thought me, our me, mob was loud. Me, 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 yeah, he is so annoying. Okay, well, now that we have all our stuff, let's just sneak back to our side, okay? Let's go. It perfect, Zoe. We made it back over to our side. Yeah, that was a little too easy. Wait, uh, uh, I fell asleep. Uh, wait, where'd my potion go? Oh my gosh, look, Nox just noticed that his potion is missing. This is hilarious. Uh, and he has no clue it was us. Lexi, did you break in and eat my potion? Wait, he thinks his dinosaur did it? Are you serious? Lexi, you can't eat stuff in my house. Well, now that we have the size changer, Zoe, we should try to use it on the frost mount. What do you think? Let's do it. And what in the world, Zoe? This guy got huge. This is perfect. He can totally take out Lexi. Yeah, this is perfect. He's like basically the same size as Lexi, so he can definitely crush her. Okay, Nox, I think Zoe and I are ready to go for this round. Is your army ready? Yeah, we are. Well, let's go ahead and drop the walls down and let's do this. Wake up, frost mount. Wake up. Get him, Lexi. And here we go and wait what in the what it just got cooked zoe how did that happen well that has to be the world's fastest round loss what, what just happened how did he just lose in like two hits that doesn't make any sense zoe maybe the potion didn't agree with him time to do the loser dance <laughs> oh my gosh honestly nox you're just lucky that uh something kind of went wrong with our person i thought we we're gonna crush you L O C R. oh my gosh you know just get back to your side nox i don't want to deal with you anymore let's just move on to the final round yeah we'll see that's not even how you spell losers uh zoe i can't believe we actually lost i totally thought we were winning that round yeah me too well whatever this is the final round zoe so if we lose this we're gonna lose the whole thing so we really need something good okay let's see what he's gonna do all right so for this round i'm gonna have to do something really really cool. I think I'm gonna have to bring back an old favorite. Natalie! Wait, what? He brought back Natalie again? Is that even allowed? I have no clue. Do you think he's just gonna leave it as Naga? Natalie, get in the box. Okay, perfect. Stay there. And blue! It, wait, so it says it turned into a Hydra? Holy cow! That thing is crazy! Oh my goodness! This thing is huge! Natalie! You've changed it to... Huh, what's a cool H name? Uh, Hildegard! Wait, Hildegard? He just called it Hildegard? Yeah, that's my grandma's name! Oh, wow. That's, uh, that's, that's kind of cool, I guess. Zoe, but what in the world are we supposed to do about that thing? I have no clue. Do you have any ideas what we should spawn in to counteract from the Hydra? Well, I do know one guy, and he's a little, uh, let's just say he's a little weird, honestly. Weird? What do you mean? Okay, Zoe, I'm thinking we spawned down the weird strict dad. Honestly, I don't like this guy at all. He is so creepy. What? He looks so cool, Zoe. He's extremely strong, so he's definitely gonna be able to help us out. Just looking at him makes my stomach hurt. Oh my gosh, whatever. Well, I think for this time, Oh, how about I flick the gray one? Okay, do it. Let's see it. It says the mob was spawned in. 
you think anything cool spawned? Yeah, semi cool. It's Nightmare Catnap. Wait, what? It spawned a Nightmare Catnap? Really? Yeah, how do you think that came out of Weird Strict Dad? Honestly, I have no idea, but I guess the color stuff is kind of broken. Yeah, it is kind of broken. But look, I got a spawn egg. That means we can spawn in even more. Oh, perfect. So wait, actually, what if we just like make his size super big and then he fights that Hydra by himself? That's a great idea. Go ahead and change his size. Come on, please get super big. It, oh my goodness, Zoe, look how big this guy got. He's super big, really close to the size of the Hydra. Yeah, this is absolutely perfect. And honestly, I think he can take down Nox all by himself. Okay, well then maybe we should see if he wants to drop the wall. Okay, Nox, Zoe and I are ready for this final round. Are you ready to lose once and for all? I'm ready to win this round. No shot you're gonna win. We're totally gonna destroy you in whatever this uh, weird big thing is. This is Hilda, it's a Hydra. This is Hilda, this thing is ugly. Yeah, hail Hilda. Come on, Nightmare Catnap, go ahead and attack this stupid weird blue dragon thing. Nightmare Catnap, you have to go. This thing is gross looking. Get this abomination off our screen. Come on, Nightmare Catnap, take him out. Take him out. Come on, Catnap, you got this. And oh gosh, he's hitting him with like a bunch of fire. So this isn't looking too good for him. I believe in Catnap. Come on, yes, he's doing damage now. Come on, Catnap. This is awesome. No, Hilda. Come on, Catnap. And yes, look, he just took him out, Zoe. That's awesome. I knew Catnap could do it. Ah, uh, whatever. That was so lame. Ha, Nox, you lost. And your stupid Hilda was so weak. Hilda. And that was a super crazy adventure. Make sure to watch the next one by clicking the video on screen. Bye, guys.